If you have the Apple AirPods 3, then the easiest way to keep the case fresh for a long time is with a case. So here I have some dirt cheap cases, all of which was bought from the TVC Mall website. And now let's see if they are any good. The first case is made out of soft silicone and has got rainbow colors on it and it also comes with a carabiner clip. The case stretches quite a bit and has a cover for the charging port. The case slips on very easily but I struggled with getting the perfect alignment. I'm not a big fan of the protruding hinge at the back as it comes in the way of wireless charging the case. But it does the job of protecting the case and the carabiner clip gives more ways of carrying the case. Next up is another soft silicone case which also has a carabiner clip but this one can also double up as an air tag holder. This has a bit more stretch than the last one but the misalignment on the front is pretty big for comfort. Another thing to note is that pressing the button on the back will not show you the LED in front as the air tag is sitting on top of it. Moving on to the next case and this is a glossy rubberized protective case made out of TPO material. Now this case I like very much because of the way it feels and looks. You get a tactile feeling of pressing the button on the back and the LED on the front can also be seen. The matte finish on the bottom and the side gives a very good hold which is very useful cause otherwise the case can be quite slippery. Then we have the nylon case which is also very flexible. I like the build quality of this case more than all the other cases that I've showed you thus far. Plus it fits perfectly which is awesome. The LED can be seen from the front and it feels super grippy on the hand. Unfortunately it did not come with a carabiner clip but other than that this case is solid. The next case is another nylon case but this one is water repellent. This also comes with a carabiner clip and has a small tape inside so that the airpods sticks to the case more securely. But even without using the tape the case fit like a glove and provided all around protection. I love to see that there is no gap around the hinge which gives more protection. There is just a small cutout at the bottom for the charging port and the LED in the front. The case opens and closes with no issues and feels great on the hands too. After that we have the snap-on lid case. It has a carbon fiber like texture on the front and as well as a button that you need to push to release the lid of the airpods case. This means that the case will never open accidentally. The button on the back brings the tactile feedback and the rubber bumper on the sides and on the back increases the protection of the case. The carabiner clip is a little bit stiff but still it's a great addition nevertheless. This case also fits really nicely so I will recommend this for anyone looking for a proper fit of the case and that rugged durability. The next case is the flexible TPU case. This also comes with a carabiner clip but it's too fat for the cutout so that's very unfortunate. But the good thing is that this case also fits the AirPods 3 case very well. You get all around protection except for the cutout at the bottom for charging. This is also shockproof case that will save your AirPods from drops. The design has its pros and cons as it has a very slim profile but adds a bit of weight. The last case is the shock resistant anti-drop case. This one comes with a key ring which can be used as a carabiner clip. This also fits really well except for the cutout around the hinge. Other than that every bit of this case is well protected. This is also very slim but the best thing is that they are also very light. The grip on the case is also really good because of the rubber bumper. Also this supports wireless charging like all the other cases. So anyways guys that's it from me today. I'll see you again next week. Bye.